So moving from your Ubuntu server to desktop is pretty simple. First of all, quickly do an lsb underscore release space dash a to get the latest information on which variant you're running. It's the Linux standard base info and includes the distribution. Next you'll need to do an apt update or a sudo apt update just to make sure that you've got everything up to date. And then to actually move to the desktop environment, you need to do an apt install Ubuntu dash desktop. This will install all the packages that you need. So it will take a little while. This will download and install all the packages that you would find on, on the desktop version of Ubuntu. Uh, and there's quite a lot of them. This is on a VM, so it, it, it took quite a bit of time. It also installs the default apps you get with Ubuntu desktop. So it, it's like putting an ISO, a desktop ISO in and booting from that. Uh, you'll need to reboot at the end of the process to complete. After the reboot, you'll see a normal desktop GUI logon session and you can log in from there. One thing you may need to do after this is visit the software and updates and then in the additional drivers tab, if there is any specific driver for graphics, you'll need to install it from there, like the NVIDIA GTX range. Uh, you can do it from command line or you can download it directly from NVIDIA or AMD or whatever. Um, it's worth noting that LSB underscore release shows the same information for both the server and the desktop environments. Anyway, I hope this helps someone and um, thanks for watching.